starting a new project. It's going to be Hang Em High. You've heard of the level. Um, going to be making it in this star made with the base. It's going to be a turret on top and a turret below it and a gravity unit. That's pretty much it. I'm going to save the sector when it's done and post it up for everyone to use. So that's the plan. Um, there we go. Now, I've got my build block. No, where is it? Build block. There we go. I've got my build block. There's a faction block on it already. I've got a bunch of hull colours. Um, I've got an undetonator as well. So, the idea is people will come in here somehow. So, we're going to have the build block there. I'm going to have the undetonator here. And we're going to build this upwards. Right, the idea is there'll be an opening to drop down into the level. So, you'll flow up to this, hit the button, and down you go. I suppose you could have different spawn points to drop down. Hmm, interesting. We'll explore that once we've actually done some. I'll come back to you in a minute. I'm going to create the floor and um, start doing the basic outline. Built it down a little ways, and now we're going to start putting the floor in. So first I'm going to put two on like that, and then using the XY symmetry, you're going to create a floor coming off like this. I'm just going to expand that out now. Okay guys, this is where I'm up to. I've done one corner here. I've put a bunch of the little ball blocks in. One of the stairways. As you can see, we've got the stairway here. And a couple of those sort of little bollards that people dodge around. And then moving on, I've done the first of these, which is like that little, little covering area, which you got there. And then I've done first of these gangways and uh, I've tried to keep the side on that right, but it's, you know, <laughs> yeah. And then I've started doing the first part of here, which of course has this little entranceway that comes up to this layer. Um, obviously I've sort of working with different scales because, you know, it's not Halo. <laughs> I'm trying to do a star made take on it. And the idea is you activate gravity and then we use the laser weapon. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna carry on because I've only done one corner. So I've done this side, I think I might have to move this because this this seems to be uh, too close to this wall now. So I might have to move that and shovel these back a little bit, but for all intents and purposes we've got this side here. I need to make sure I've got all these little covering bits. Um, I finished doing this bit here, so it's a bit dark, but I'm going to sort the lighting out afterwards. Um, and then I started doing this, so you come up the stairs, trust me if you turn down there there's a passageway and like I say I need to sort the lighting out but the tunnel goes through here and like I need to put some lighting in, it's pitch black, you can't see it. Anyway, <laughs> um, that's where I'm at and I'm just starting to do this sort of top level, started doing that. Um, this ramp's done. That's the main ramp. So I'm just doing the inside of this sort of block here. I'm going to get this tunnel to lead round to it. And, um, and then put a few windows in there. And then after that, carry on with the rest of the room. So here we are, another update. I've built the tower on this side. It's got the staircase leading in here and going up and around to the top platform. I've tried to do my best to line it all up, but obviously it'll never truly fit exactly. So uh, I've got the bridge in here, I've got the demote in here, um, uh, the two sky bridges are finished. So they go around the top to the top platform and then you can jump to that platform just like in the original. I've done the lighting on these tunnels now, so we can have a look at that. There's the section. That's looking down, that's looking up. We'll go back down this tunnel. Straight down to the end, and then we've got this section here. Now I wanted to just put, um, I wanted to just put uh, just like a hole, but I didn't want people to run out, so I put plex glass at the top, and you've actually got to come to the back and shoot down like that, so you can't just, you know, but then here I put the glass on the bottom so you could shoot above the line. It's a bit awkward, but I just don't really want people running through. Anyway, because uh, it was only a slit, it was either that or you'd only be able to see that. 
which I suppose I might change it to that because there's only a thin slit in the original. We come up this ramp and we get to the top and we get the top of this building here and I'm going to do some detail adjustment but that's that platform on that corner done. There's the bridge connecting to the middle so all I've got to do is this bit here and we're done. Okay, I'm pretty much done. I've done this side, I've put all of the cover in. Um, I'm hoping that players can actually get around this. I'm hoping that they don't get stuck trying to get through these pillars, but it should look cool. Um, I've done the, uh, the um, I don't know what you'd call that, gantry? I don't know, the way, the path that goes around the edge there. I just noticed it's thicker on this side than it is on that side, but I don't really think that's too important. It's close enough. <laughs> um, I've got this bit of cover in here. Um, the bridges are in, like I say. I'm just trying to see, is there anything I haven't... Uh, it's looking pretty good, to be honest. So I'll just do it. There you go. The idea is that players can come along, hit the gravity at the top, and then fall into the uh, fall into the level. Just could do with a little bit of see because Halo was quite bland in terms of decoration on some of these levels, and this is one of the most basic blocky levels. So I thought, okay, we can't make triangles like anyway. So some of the ramps are wrong, and the scale's a little bit off too. But then we can't run that fast, so I don't want to... <laughs> you just be running around for ages. But I'd love to get this online. I'm going to put this on my server, I reckon. What I'm going to do is I'm going to build a station around this. And um, make it part of a faction as an HQ. Uh, different faction to the one I normally play in, though. And then I'll export the sector and uh, make it available for download. Because... This is, this is quite a bit of fun, and I'm going to do more of these. This didn't even take that long. This took me a couple, maybe an hour or two. And I've got it all... It's, it's roughly right. I mean, <laughs> I'm sure there's a few bits and pieces that are wrong, but I've done my best. And you know, Apart from sort of like spacing these differently or doing it on a completely different scale, so like much, much larger, um, I think that's the best you're going to get. So... Like I say, it's all here. That's hang 'em high, Star Maid style. setback but um, in that when I was putting blocks underneath I wanted to have like a decent 10 layer thick armor on each side so I put a bunch of blocks underneath in a funky pattern and I didn't realize that a few of them actually punched through the floor of the roof of the level which is no good so I've, I've fixed it now and um, like I say it's construction went pretty well it's starting to look recognisable. Can't wait to join some people, or uh, uh, you know, can't wait to see this getting used. So all you need is the laser pistol and run about. I'm just sort of devising a way of bringing people back to life, or a way of deploying people in. Um, really, it wants to be blind, so there's no way they know where people are on the map, and all I need to do is drop in from above using the gravity well. So. Uh, I ran out of glass, I can't quite finish it, but it's here, it's done, uh, I'm going to make it available for upload soon. Um, so you can put it in your server world and then just go to wherever you put it and use it. No messing around. So that's that. I'll probably do more of these if people like it. 
thanks for watching as usual come back next time uh, lots of new stuff coming so keep coming back and checking us out see you soon